as we uh, walk the valley, I often reminisce about when I was a kid and I see come to where I'm standing at right now, watching the sunrise, feeling the energy of the valley. Sometimes I go for hikes, I run, but I love to take photos of this valley. It's such a beautiful place to be. I do go to Kealaki Kobe. I run down the trail from the backside. I swim across the bay. I walk along the shoreline. I can take myself into the time period emotionally and mentally, and that will give me an even more deeper respect for, for the land and the people that once lived there. I relate to the land. It speaks to me not in words, but in, in feelings and emotions. So in order for me to keep my sanity, I have to go out there. And even if I do nothing, I just need to be out there. You know, the energy that's within that food from farm to land, it'll revitalize your soul if you allow it. Beautiful morning on Kailua Bay. We're headed to Waimea, what do you suggest? You gotta check out Big Island Brew House and tell Jane I say hi. Don't forget about Jane, Big, Big Island Brew House. House. I am Jane, and this is where the beer magic happens. Waimea is one of the bread baskets for the island and the state. As I drive past Kahalu and I see all these kids, and what are they doing? They're surfing. Now, surfing was actually born here in Hawaii. Doesn't matter what skill level you are, you can take part in something that's been in Hawaii for generations. Live aloha, yeah? You know, I, I've never ever been in a fight in my life. I surround myself with positive energy, aloha spirit, and uh, it, it comes full circle. Today we're serving Ono, tomorrow might be Mahi. It's all depending on what Jeff Silva catches and what Ocean provides. So the food will taste that much better when you have someone passionate about the food that they're giving to you. It came from this very island that you're on. 